My name is Mark Rowley and I play Finnan. Uh, my name is Arnas Federovicius and I play Citric. So we're going to answer a few questions, so if you just want to use the hashtag uh, ask TLK. Thank you very much. And thank you for tuning in and ask weird questions. Yay! <laughs> um, we, we actually live in the same house in reality, so we get to switch roles. Sometimes oh. he cooks. Yep, sometimes he cooks. Sometimes I clean. I never clean. <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> well, so good. I, was, I just loved it. The, this is so badass. Yeah. He, I, I, I walked around it for a very long time after we wrapped even. <laughs> I put it on early just to feel cool. <laughs> no, I didn't read all the books. Uh, I was aware that they were out there. Um, but yeah, when I got the job, I, I read all of them. Same, but I've only read seven so far. Well, I did swear my sword to Utrid, so... Hopefully he'll let me join Team Utrid. If I'm being completely honest, it felt like a theme park ride. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Like, uh, they had this ship which was like up in midair on a crane and it'd swing from side to side and water was blasting in and everything. And by the end of that scene, I was just like, oh my God, this is the best thing ever. But I was scared, I'm not gonna lie. Well, that would be a hard fight. i probably have to say Probably Utrecht. But, I mean, if we teamed up, we totally probably kick his ass. Totally, totally. <laughs> uh, I think I would go Clapper, just because he's so big and massive and he could lift anything. <laughs> like, the guy could probably lift a cart and throw it at the enemies, I don't know, anything. <laughs> uh, and I'd like to be Ethelwald, because he's nasty and yeah. annoying and it'd be just so fun to do all those nasty things he does. He could throw you. <laughs> <laughs> I love Siegfried. He's so dark in his voice. Mm. Exactly so that. Sexy. I wouldn't like to change anything. I just really, really want to explore more of his life. Well, first of all, it's very authentic that there are so many nationalities working here. And, and I believe that it, it was very interesting for me because there are so many different approaches from every different country, like acting wise. It's kind of like uh, like everyone represents their own country, so actually some of the guys from Sweden all get together and then it's kind of us versus them, which is quite <laughs> nice. Yeah, I loved it and you were you were really good at it. You could do that horse jump. Do you know you could just oh, jump yeah, on the horse? I, yeah, I, I did that. I actually, just a year before I got this role, I for some reason started learning horse riding and it became very useful. It's really nice to get caught up in that, uh, that aggression because uh, no one really gets to experience it on a day-to-day -day basis but when you're constantly battling you get that sheer rush of adrenaline going yeah. through your body. Plus we, we all worked out together on a daily basis so we had that feel of a team and when we had fights we d really did feel for each other so, yeah. so it was really good. Painful because of what we just saw. Heartful. Um, because really your heart goes out to every title that's been through a traumatic event. And friendship, because it lasts forever. I mean, some of the horses were like professional stun horses for 25 years. And when, you, when, when we would shoot something and the director would say cut, they would just stop, turn around and go to their first position. And you'd be like, whoa, whoa. Do we even have to ride them? Yeah, sometimes. Not always, but... Um... I did get a lot of training, uh, it's kind of like an apprenticeship, you kind of learn as you go along, kind of warrior school, um, but luckily I've you know, been fighting as an actor for a while on stage and on screen, so. And we had a great stunt master trainer yeah. at Levente, so. Yeah, he's brilliant. Yeah. Well, I mean, Mark is crazy, so that pretty much sums it up. <sighs> yeah. And uh, he's a sexy warrior. I mean, just look at Okay. I loved it because I never had a beard before and I kept it for a bit longer. You kind of suited it. What? You suited it. I, thank you. Thank you. What about you? Uh, yeah, it was really cool for the first couple of days and then I was like, oh my god, it takes three hours to put on. 
oh, the costume, the great costume department has given us so many jackets and boots and warm clothes that we never actually felt cold. No. And coffee. Just loads of hot coffee. Loads. Finn and mate, just be patient, alright? Don't do anything crazy, just be patient. <laughs> and I'd say, trust yourself and don't be afraid. Um, he's, he's great. So nice. Yeah, he's love working really with really him. Nice. Yeah. It's a good laugh as well. Are we done? Yeah, we got that. Cool. I hate that guy. He's always late on set. Such an ass, man. Such an ass. Thanks for joining us and thank you for all of your questions. I hope you really, we hope you really enjoyed the episode and our presence. Stick around because every week and after every episode, there's going to be loads of Q&As with other characters. This is Mark. This is Anish.